I remember when this tree used to be standing. <clears throat> it fell, well, I don't remember, two years ago? <clears throat> so I went out on the trail because I was, you know, tempted. You can hear the traffic in town. But I'm not in my trail shoes, so I've already almost fallen. I've barely been on this. <clears throat> so, let's see. Is it day 26? Um, run 40-something. About 32 degrees out. I really just wanted to come on here and go up this big hill and come back down. This section doesn't seem as bad as the one that I slid down. Let's come out here on the play in the snowy trail. It was, you could maybe see some flurries. It was snowing a little harder when I left the house. I don't have much time to be out, so I'm not gonna get all my miles in right now. Uh, so it'll have to be like a two-part day, maybe three. Just depends how things go. Um, I could wrap up the virtual race today. I have 13.2 miles left. I just could not do another day on the treadmill. Well, it was very convenient with how busy things are. Yeah, I've even been getting some work done just using one hand and my phone <laughs> while I do these treadmill runs and it helps with time, make the time go by quickly. I see the traffic up there. Oh, this is nice. Okay, so... Uh, after I do... After I finish this virtual race, next is make a chiropractor appointment and take a few days off from running. And uh, then the 11th, well, I want to add in um, strength training again with weights and kettlebell. And then on the 11th of February is the Butler County Milers Soul Crusher Saturday. So kind of do a mini ramp up for that. And uh, then a few days off before that. And then do that event. Uh, so that one, it's it seems like it's going to be pretty hard. Um, I believe the... So it's basically like a hill repeat challenge. We have four hours to do as many hill repeats as we can. Uh, it's definitely take your trekking poles. Uh, I think the... I gotta relook up all these stats, but I think it's like over six miles. And uh, 
I think over a thousand feet elevation gain per like out and back or loop or whatever. Um, and it's unmanicured. It's basically on a power line, not necessarily even a trail. Unmanicured jagger bushes. Uh, I don't know, they use the word scramble, so whatever that looks like. Rocks. So it sounds like it's going to be pretty rugged. So that'll be different. That'll be fun. Coming up to the top of my hill. Let's just run this. I'm not going to be able to go fast coming down. Not in these shoes. And this is where it ends. Because we've got property, another property. I don't even know what's up there, but it's a property. Some kind of field. I think there's usually something growing in there. Okay, here we go. Alright, I'm back. Alright, so I got in 10k. Um, I gotta go get the little one and probably run late tonight after I meet with a client. Oh, it's cold, like my hand is like, I can barely move it, and I had on gloves. Yeah, so I decided I wasn't going to record coming back home. I just, I picked up the pace, which felt really nice, um, especially on slight downhills. And I went back this one road, which I forgot, there's like always a headwind. You ever like run somewhere and... You go this one particular direction, and then there's like a headwind the entire stretch. It was like that, and uh, it, it's a cold, <laughs> cold headwind. So um, that was fun. Ugh. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna. I don't know. I'm hungry. I had uh, like seriously, I had two plates of spaghetti before this run, and <laughs> I'm just burning through stuff with all this running. So, I need to go eat again. All right guys, um, I'll keep you updated as I wrap up this virtual race. I was really thinking about just doing it. I'm almost um, halfway to, to the 13.2 miles that I need. Uh, so I think I might just knock it out tonight. That'll be awesome. <laughs> It'll feel so good. <laughs> and then I can just chill out for a little bit. All right. Um, oh, also, I'm enjoying watching everybody else who's participating as well. Good luck to you. Uh, I've been talking with some of you. You're like right around where I'm at. We'll be wrapping it up today, tomorrow. It's fantastic. My husband, Steven's still doing his. Um, and uh, he should be, he'll, he'll be wrapping it up uh, maybe this weekend. So that'll be good. All right, I'll, I'll see you later.